Hello everyone, thank you for joining my studio today. Today I want to discuss how to remove lines from your table. If you want to remove the row lines, you want to see how you can do that. And some, sometimes you make a table and you want to make sure that your table is presented in a professional way. So let's start by creating table. Let's go to insert and table. Let's say we need, let's make use of uh, four columns and maybe about four or five rows. Uh, first row here, let's put item uh, serial number. We can just put serial number. So let's put S slash N. And the next column would be for the name of the item. So name and description. Description of your item is gonna be there. And then we have lastly we have uh, the price up here. Let's assume we have item number one to be a bag tissue. Bag tissue and description is for restroom use. And the price for that, let's put it at $32. Let's go back to the next row. And our second item would be pen. So for a pen, we have for office use as our description. And let's see, for pen, let's just put that at $15. And the third uh, row, let's have a stapler there. Ready? And we have a for office use as the description. Then let's put the price of that. Maybe that's seven dollars. Okay, this is your table ready. But you may not want to present the table like this. There are better ways to do to present your table. You can decide to make the first line bold. You can that differentiates the line from other lines. Now another thing we can do is to remove the lines here we can decide to remove the lines and what we do is we go here or we either you use f1 or you go to your paragraph uh, pane and we click down on this and you see no border you can see all the lines are removed but that will not still look good. We need to remove this also. You can actually do everything together, remove everything together. So let's go to no border for this one. So, so we have removed all the lines. Now we want to put line back for the heading. So what we do is we go back and we put top border you can see we have there because this is to the heading you can you put a bottom the bottom line for that one because it's highlighted already so we go to the bottom border to see how that is separated from this now and to make the whole thing look good you can go back and highlight this and put bottom border 
at that too. So this looks much prettier and uh, professional. And that is all we do for this uh, video. Thank you for joining us. You can subscribe to our channel and give us thumb up. We do appreciate that. And if you have any suggestion, you can put in for us. We try 